Hello, my friends of Catri Labs. Uh, my name is Ur Motoya. In this tutorial, what we are going to do is we are going to create an innovative process that where you can download satellite imagery. In this case, is actually a potranspiration. Uh, is actually a potranspiration images from the that is the product MID sixteen A two. Okay, but instead of doing a research, selecting the area on uh, on air data, we are going to do that in Python. Okay, so you are going to you are well, you are going to see the code, and you will see how easy it is to download the data through Python. Okay, so here we are in Jupyter Lab. So I'm going to restart, clear all outputs. Okay, first. You have once you have to run this to install the package air access. Air access gives you access to a whole variety of um, to a whole variety. I mean to almost and I think to almost all the to the the collections that are here in air data. Okay, where I have found Landsat, I have found uh, Sentinel, I have found. Uh, other um, uh, Asterdam and so on. Okay, so well, I have already imported. Okay, first we have to log in. Okay, so you, for example, this is my this is my user and this is my password. Okay, I don't want to store that. Okay, great. So I am already logged in. Okay, if you want to know more about the search data that is the kind of the core tool that downloads the data so you can just go and read more about this okay great okay and here what you are going to see is the access to search data okay so we are going to look for the code mid 16a2 okay mid 16a2 Okay, because this is the nickname of the uh, product that is related to Modis Aqua Net Evapotranspiration every eight days on a resolution of 500 meters. Okay, great. So for this case, we are going to uh, use Cloud Hosted. Okay, that is an option. Okay, but for this tutorial, we are only going to look for the values in 10 days. Okay. So the for the first of January 2021 to the 10th of January of 2021. Okay, great. And it say okay, there are two images in this area, but for this area in this time frame. Okay, so we can uh, we can go to the to access. Uh, we can get the data links. Okay, in there are two types of data links. When in this case is direct, it works. Okay, and then here we have the two objects. Okay, the two images that we have one for the first of January, and then when the second is for the ninth of January. Okay, and well, if the access were external, you have to use this one. Okay, and where you store the data okay by downloading the data from the results okay from the results uh, you can just run this okay and it will queue the task okay and it has a progress bar that for every image that is downloading it will appear here okay sometimes it gives you some kind of it gives you some kind of um, warnings and so on. But what I have seen is that they finally the image are downloaded. Okay, so I can go here to the folder that I have created. Okay, and these are the two images. Okay. Mm -hmm. I don't know why it's still. Okay, we can go to the. We can go to the image too, and the image are there, but I don't know why it's still taking some time to finish. Ah, okay. Well, it has finished. 
Okay, great. So here we have, well, this is from a previous uploaded file. So I'm going to remove. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, go to the downloaded files. Okay. I open the HDF and the layer of actual evapotranspiration is this one. Okay, because this is potential evapotranspiration, this is actual evapotranspiration. So we add this and if you want to see in another scale, you have to go to properties, cinder ball pseudo color and quantile. Okay, great. And this is the representation where you have the, um, if, if you want to know more about the, the image, you have to go to the documentation of the process. Okay. So, and then it will say that you, all the values here has a scale factor of 0 0.01. Okay. Great. So then you have, you have all the information. Then you will have as well the information, the script for to download the files. And as you have seen, the process is really, really easy. And with that, you can have you can have real in short time you can have great amount of data okay so thank you for thank you for uh, watching this video my name is Hol Montoya see you in coming tutorials in coming um, webinars and courses and have a great day bye bye bye